it. Says no tie. My suit, my shirt, my belt, my speeches are in the, the socks are in the shoes. Yeah, I'm just saying at three o'clock yeah. you'll come up. So but you won't. <laughs> <laughs> Because you'll have time to change. You don't have to call it a tag then. We can't accept no loss. I know, Romney and Jim are all ready. They're like, yeah, we're ready for some horseshoes. I'm going to be like, why is no one here in their seats? Everyone's down there, you hear them screaming on the beach. <laughs> <laughs> He's so really worried about passing out. He's so worried. He's going to pass out. He's so worried about it. You're going to have to make me interject something that's not in my seat. Man down. And now he's, he's wearing a tie. I'm like, it's gonna be like too tight or something you watch. He's gonna be doing these. <laughs> you know, that you were able to take breather yourself and still mm -hmm. mingle. He said, yeah, well, Abby was right. I said, well, get used to that phrase because you're gonna have to use that quite a bit. <laughs> <laughs> well, he did well though, not showing that he was nervous. Because I didn't really notice that he was nervous. Yesterday? No, when you propose. Oh, okay. That would be quite funny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that would be happy. Here, you're going to say, who are you? <laughs> <laughs> so I'm like, I wonder. And then you'll pull the tissue out, and it'll be all like, okay. Yeah. <laughs> There would be very nice Someone to love me right There will be very nice Someone to understand Each little dream it means Someone to take my hand To be a team with me
please be seated. Jared and Abby actually made it. So, uh, before we formally begin, I'd like you to take a moment to appreciate everything that's going on right now. It's a unique moment in time. First, you are surrounded by family and friends, the people who love you, who have in some cases raised you, nurtured you. There are people here who, I'm guessing, with whom you have laughed. I'm guessing they're soon not so much. <laughs> I was speaking to Abby. Yeah, I got it. <laughs> And uh, I'm guessing there are some people here with whom you have cried. Again, probably yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that, <was laughs> that was Jared. Okay, good. It's good to know where that works. But these are the people who love you and whom you love. The family, not just your relatives, but the family of people uh, who are devoted to you and share in your love and your joy today. And you're surrounded obviously also by this amazing scenery. We hear the ocean behind us, see it over our shoulder, uh, and the brilliant uh, sun in this beautiful day to bring the two of you together. And so you come here in a spirit of joy and anticipation. Joy that you have found each other and created this amazing relationship together, but also anticipation. Anticipation of everything that is yet to come for the two of you and your families moments of great joy, moments of disappointment along the way, but you'll share them all, and you'll be together through all of them. And so we celebrate that and, and so much more today about the home the two of you create together, hopefully a little bit larger than this one, although <laughs> this one, is, this is, I know, Los Angeles Homes, this is pretty good size, but it's also beautiful. <laughs> We're going to uh, turn to the wine, a symbol of joy in Jewish tradition. <laughs> I didn't say a big glass of wine, it's a little <laughs> sip. Um, at uh, holidays, festivals, special moments. I'm going to ask you to hold this cup together. As, okay, as we offer the uh, blessing, Baruch Ataronai Elohinu Melech HaOlam, Borei Pri Hagafen. Blessed are you, Lord our God, sovereign of the universe, creator of the fruit of the vine, and the joy of bride and groom. Jared and Abby, you, uh, you have created so much together during your time together. It was a relationship that uh, happened pretty instantaneously. Texting got you going. Uh, and it's such a 21st century thing, but... Um, and, uh, and you seemed to know right away that there was something very special here. I think, Abby, you said that uh, you declared that you were going to be marrying Jared within moments of... Maybe moments is an exaggeration, but, but pretty soon after, uh, after meeting him, which we can all understand, of course. Uh, <laughs> and now I'm going to uh, ask you, in the presence of God and this assembly, do you, Jared, with everything that you know and everything that you've experienced, take Abby to be your wife, to love, to honor, and to cherish? <laughs> smart, yeah, smart move. <laughs> and you, Abby, with everything that you know and everything that you've experienced, take Jared to be your husband, to love, to honor, and to cherish. Good, we get to continue then. <laughs> Jared, if you'll hold this ring, as you place this uh, ring upon the finger finger of your bride, say to her these words, be consecrated to me, be consecrated to me, with this ring, with this ring, as my wife, as my wife, in keeping with ancient traditions, in keeping with ancient traditions, and our own distinctive love and commitment, and our own distinctive love and commitment.
Abby, as you place this uh, ring upon the finger of your groom, say to him, say to him these words. Be consecrated to me. Be consecrated to me this ring. with this ring as my husband. As my husband. In keeping with ancient traditions and our, own distinctive love and, commitment. and our own distinctive love and commitment. Jared, we're going to put you to work. I'm going, uh, keeping with Jewish tradition, I'm going to place this glass down. You're going to stomp on it as many times as it takes till it breaks. <laughs> Mom is cheering you on. It's grass, it's a little bit soft. When it, when it breaks, everybody's going to shout Mazel Tov, congratulations, whatever, and then, and then the two of you may, if you choose, kiss. So hot that I melted, I fell right through the cracks. Now I'm trying to get back. Before the cool done run out, I'll be giving it my best. This and nothing's gonna stop me but divine intervention. I reckon it's again my turn to win some or learn some. But I won't have it's our take no more, no more. It cannot wait. I'm yours. Mm -hmm. Everything's falling out. Well, open up your mind and see like me. Open up your plans and damn, you're free. I look into your heart and you find love.
then you know what it feels like when she had you and me. Alone if you feel 
Baby. 